I complicate things One of my many skills I'm making things Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today and probably over the next couple of days, it's Monday, it's a new week. I need to do like a weekly reset on our house and get groceries and stuff. Uh, we've got a, like a mess going on. Our house isn't necessarily dirty with like dirt because I do vacuum for the most part every day, but there's just stuff everywhere. It was Maverick's birthday last weekend and then just this like a couple days ago on Saturday, we had another birthday party to go to for our nephew. Um, so we just haven't really been home to like give the house a good clean. We've got toys all over the place from Maverick's birthday party because he got a bunch of toys for his birthday and then wanted to play with them and his bedroom's upstairs. And so we spend the majority of our time down here on the main floor. So his toys just kind of got set up down here. We've got some on the dining room table. We've got some on the kitchen island. We've got a bunch of toys in the living room. We've got a mess in the closet where they were playing, where everybody was playing when everybody was over here. So we've just got a lot of stuff that needs to get done and put away. I also need to bake a new loaf of bread because we're out of bread for Addie to take for school. So this video is just going to be a compilation of just a bunch of cleaning, putting stuff back where it goes. I've got two loads of laundry on the floor upstairs that needs to be folded, plus two more loads in the washer and dryer. So lots of laundry, lots of putting toys away, lots of picking up and cleaning, and then making a loaf of bread, hopefully either today or tomorrow. I also need to do a Walmart order, grocery order, so that we can have groceries for the week because we're out of like fruit and everything. So that is what we are going to do today. Before I get into the cleaning, I'll just give you guys a rundown of what everything looks like right now so you don't think I'm just making it up that the house is a mess. I'm sure our mess looks different to other people's mess, but this right now is like super anxiety with the amount of stuff that is everywhere because nothing is put back where it goes. <laughs> so I will show you guys what we're working with. So we've got the kids hang out and Aria's get away from everybody. Just toys everywhere, nothing's put back where it goes. He got a bunch of new magnet tiles and stuff for his birthday and he's been playing with them and so they're just kind of thrown everywhere. We've got stuff that needs to go upstairs. He also got a skateboard for his birthday that he's obsessed with so it's constantly out here on the floor everywhere. It's a cool dinosaur skateboard. And then we've got, he wanted to do these, but I told him he had to wait for dad to come home because I didn't want to get into that with a baby. We've got some Amazon stuff that needs to get hung up in the garage. We've got one of his toys that he got for his birthday that he's obsessed with that we put here just so he could play with it. And it's been here this whole time and so it's just a mess. I find these all over the floor. And he just put this together this morning, another birthday present but we've got just kind of stuff everywhere. We've got this over the weekend, so this is just out and playing with. I've got some Halloween stuff that needs to get put away. These Halloween costumes need to go in the Halloween costume bin. We've got breakfast from this morning. Some leftover cookies from his birthday. I pulled the bread maker out this morning so we can make bread. We also got these over the weekend, which I'm kind of obsessed with. It's one of those hearth in hand casserole dishes. A Christmas cookie jar and Christmas plate, which are so cute. But we've got dishes in the sink. We've got the little blue light is on there, meaning that that's clean and needs to get put away. We still have birthday balloons out everywhere. Boys everywhere. Pillows, more toys. He got this track for his birthday and he's obsessed with it, so it's been out this whole time. He plays with it every day. I'm not really sure what to do with it or where to put it, but it's a cool little blue track. We still have birthday decorations out in the mix of Christmas decorations because we got these Christmas decorations this weekend and he had to have them up. 
but I need to take down his birthday decorations. Plus his name birthday decoration over there and all needs to go in his bin. We still have his balloon arch up that I need to take down. It just took forever to put up, you know, so you gotta get, you gotta get the most use of it as you can. So yeah, just lots of toys living room that needs to be picked up, etc. And then upstairs, we have a donation bag that I started. I still have birthday stuff out from when I was printing on my Cricut. I still have my Cricut out that needs to get put away. I've got lots of laundry. Some Christmas stuff that we got over the weekend for a little tree that we're gonna put up here and I got this kids train set that I'm excited to put out around the little Christmas tree that we got but we'll see how it, how it looks and how it works but yeah just lots of stuff his room is a mess toys everywhere from when kids were playing in here just lots of stuff to clean up Knox's room isn't that bad we need to put the trundle back in Addie's room underneath her bed because his dad leaves back for Mexico tomorrow so we'll have to do that too since we don't need it so yeah just lots of stuff that needs to be put away so that is what we are going to be doing in this video. So first we are going to tackle the kitchen. I've got some clean dishes that I need to put away and then dirty dishes to stack and then I'm going to wipe down the counter and the stove and then tackle the kitchen island. I like to start in the kitchen because that's basically where everybody is all the time. <laughs> and so if this area of the house is cleaned, I feel much less anxiety about my day. So, all in my mind, cause I analyze their body language. I hear every change in their tone. Maybe they hate me somehow. I play me. My mama said, That's just the way to. So now I'm going to refill my 
like all purpose cleaner that I use to clean all surfaces of my house. Pretty much. I generally use the thieves cleaner. So you'll see me refill that in a second, but right now I'm putting some holiday oils in to make it smell kind of more festive because I'm definitely in the holiday spirit. We got everything we need right here. Wine and burning chemistry. You and me alone. You and me alone. Inside of our embassy. Everything we need right here. Make me sing along. Sing along. I never thought I'd ever be stuck by you. Ooh. I never thought I'd ever be stuck by you. Oh, watch me. Get out of life You feel that beat, yeah. 
in the kitchen I found like a spot on this rug that had some kind of food on it so I'm cleaning that really quick I'm assuming it's probably from Maverick's party because we had so many people walking in and out of our kitchen Now that the kitchen and dining room are vacuumed and cleaned up, we are going to tackle the living room. I'm going to pick up all of the toys all over the ground. The little basket we have underneath our coffee table right here is all of the toys for Knox, like all of his little baby toys. And then everything that I'm gathering and putting on top of the coffee table are Mavericks toys that need to be put away either in the front closet where they play or in his bedroom. vacuuming is done we are going to tackle this closet underneath our stairs that all of the kids have their toys in that's like their little toy play closet and filled your mind with doubt you want to stay chill right now and don't let your eyes off the prize i know you want it
everything I wanted to get done on the main floor is done. I'm moving upstairs and doing some laundry and pulling everything out of the dryer and putting it on the ground in this giant pile because that's just the easiest way I found to fold laundry up here. And then I'm going to transfer everything from the washer into the dryer. Knox clearly did not want me to <laughs> fold laundry. He just kept trying to climb into my lap. So he's the cutest thing ever. So I'm just giving him some loves really quick while I finish laundry. delivery um, I just got back from taking Addie to school and then the Walmart guy was waiting outside for me to sign for some medicine <laughs> so I just got my Walmart delivery so I'm going to unpackage that and then I'll give you guys a little haul and then I'll put it away I don't need this no more I don't need to stay if you walk up that door my mistake giving you love girl Lord. hope you find someone that can really adore you don't worry I ain't keeping grudges Cause I'm doing better, life cannot be more golden But honestly I won't lie, sometimes I ask why I can't get you out my hand, I ought to forget that I I really need to cut you off You're always trying to lead me on You're making all these promises And you'd always quit, you were just another hypocrite No one can't she got no way No, you thought that I would always stay But you thought I'd be yours and she got my mind on no bite Someone tell me Okay, I didn't get a ton this week because I didn't need a lot and I'm trying to use the food that we have in our fridge, in our pantry, but we've all been recovering from a little cold. So Jamin really likes these. I can't take them because I'm breastfeeding, but I got these for Jamin for the next time we are sick. <laughs> I got some organic snacks for Knox along with some organic teethers because he loves these. And then I got some gluten-free snacks. Maverick loves these. Bananas, some gluten-free pretzels. Got these little bars to try. They're gluten-free, which is nice for me. And Addie loves taking bars to school. So I got these. These are my favorite protein bars. And Walmart has the cheapest price on these, if you guys are wondering. They're more expensive literally everywhere else. On Amazon, even on Thrive Market, they're more expensive. So Walmart has the cheapest set, like box of them. Because they are not cheap, they are pretty expensive. Some more gluten-free crackers, Oreos, strawberries, some gluten-free bagels. I'm gonna make a pasta for dinner. Um, so I got some gluten-free penne. 
And then this week I'm gonna make some like teriyaki, what is it? Teriyaki ground turkey like lettuce cups. So I got some of the romaine lettuce to put them in with some water chestnuts. And then I got some soup because it's soup season. It's nice and cold outside and we're all either sick or recovering from being sick. So soup is literally the best thing for that. So I got some, they have some gluten-free baked potato soup, Panera soup, which is bomb. The kids love mandarin oranges and these were more, these were cheaper than the cups that you get and they only ever eat like a few of them with lunch or with dinner, so I got this. Maverick loves snacking on cheese, so I got these. I got a big block of cheese for me to snack on with my gluten-free crackers. And then these were for the lettuce cups I got that I'm gonna make this week. So not a very big haul because I have a lot of food in our fridge. I just needed a couple extra snacks for Knox, medicine, some fruit, a couple gluten-free things. Pretty small. So now I'm going to put it away. so that she could see them better because I'll put them in these snack bags and then put them in one of our little snack trays. That way she can grab them for lunches so they don't go bad before they get eaten.
with the bread currently in the bread machine, I'm moving upstairs and finally putting away my Cricut and rearranging our little console table here, putting all of the stuff I use to create all of Maverick's birthday decorations away, finally getting rid of the garbage, reorganizing, putting everything that's just accumulated on this desk here, like a kid's toothbrush and a water bottle and a hair tie and all that good stuff, some toys, just putting it all away. So the last thing we are getting to in this video, it was a two day process to get here, <laughs> but we are picking up Maverick's bedroom from all of the toys and stuff that were brought out during his birthday party when all the kids and stuff were playing up here. So we are just trying to clean the best we can while I've got two kids in there trying to play with everything that I'm putting away. But this is everything I've got for you guys in this video. I want to thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you don't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. as it's gonna get for now guys it's pointless to clean a kid's bedroom when they're in it playing <laughs>